Welcome to Take 5, your five-minute inspirational message from Solid Rock Drogheda. The book of Psalms was the songbook for the Old Testament church. Such great wisdom, such passion, such a heart that we see for God in those songs that they would sing unto the Lord. So many of them written by David, others by Asaph, the sons of Korah, and so many other great servants of the Lord. The book of Psalms starts off in Psalm 1. Blessed is the one who does not walk in step with the wicked, who does not stand in the way of sinners, and who does not sit in the company of mockers. And here we have a warning about who we spend our time with. Now, it's not just talking about briefly meeting people. These are people who we spend significant amount of time with. Whether you're walking, walking in step with the wicked. Whether you're standing, standing in the way of the sinner. Or whether you're sitting, sitting in the company of the mockers. There's no doubt that we become like the people that we spend time with. If we spend time with people who are foul-mouthed, don't be surprised. If you suddenly find curse words slipping out under moments of pressure or when you hit your thumb with a hammer, you become like the people you spend time with. That's why we need to be very careful about who we spend our time with. That's why we need to choose carefully who we're going to spend our quality time with. Now, sometimes that choice is not made for us. Sometimes that choice is made by others. You know, sometimes you're in, in, if you're at college, if you're at work, you know, you don't have a choice maybe of who you're spending time with. But when you have a choice, choose carefully who you spend time with. I want to just zero in on the third of those that said, do not walk in step with the wicked, do not stand in the way of sinners. But the third one was, do not sit in the company of mockers. There's no doubt today that a lot of Christians, including a lot of young Christians, are sitting in the company of mockers. It's about talking about the amount of time that they spend online. You know, the average person in the Western world spends an average of two hours, 24 minutes every day on social media. That's an incredible amount of time. You might say, well, I spend a lot less than that. Yeah, and that means then if that's the average, then there's other people spend a lot more than that online. Now, who are we spending time with online? You might say, well, no, I'm just on my own. I'm just scrolling. Yeah, but what kind of stuff are you scrolling through? Because that is who you are spending your time with. I am concerned that very often a lot of stuff that is online, a lot of stuff that people, including Christians, spend their time on, is mocking those who think differently. Now, there's nothing wrong with standing up for our beliefs. There's, no, there's nothing wrong with engaging in debate with those, and conversation with those who believe differently, particularly if rather than a desire, out of a desire to humiliate them or wh score points against them, we are genuinely trying to reach them with the truth of Jesus Christ. But there's a lot of stuff on social media which is basically mocking other people, putting them down, laughing at them. And you know what? We might say, but that's okay because we're on the right side. You know, if I'm, if I'm reading stuff from other Christians that's laughing at atheists, that's okay. Actually, it's not. If we spend our time mocking others, then we are breaking a commandment from the word of God that says, do not sit in the company of mockers. And that extends to who we spend time with online. You know, it's good to check ourselves. I'm, I'm not saying this in order to be condemning. I'm not saying this in order to be a killjoy. But I am saying that it's good for us to examine ourselves and say, Lord, who am I spending time with? Whether it's spending time physically or spending time online. I'm going to become like the people I'm with. If I'm spending time with mockers, I'm going to become a cynical, mocking person. And is that who I really want to be? God bless you today. Join us again tomorrow for another Take 5, your five-minute inspirational message from Solid Rock Drada. Thank <laughs> you.